This step, I like to take the Sephora 99 brush. These brushes are really good. And of course, you gotta make sure that there's no creasing under the eyes and keep them looking like this. I take this one only under the eye because it's luminous. <laughs> it's like a highlighter. It looks so good though. It was so strange for me in the beginning, but I've been doing this every day and I love it. So I'm patting this just right here under the eye, twisting to keep the form or the shape of the highlight, okay? And it's gonna all come together once I apply my face powder, for which I've done a separate video, but you may see a little bit of that here in this video. So pressing and stamping it to just stay right there, you feel me? Then I wipe this off and use a different pressed powder because this one is not luminous. And I put this in the other highlighted areas. I like to use this because it has a color to it, okay? Your setting powder can be with a color. It can have a color to it, a tan color that matches your skin tone well enough where it's going to highlight it, but not be too much. 